We love the 2024 Acura Integra Type S. It takes all the good things about the Honda Type R and civilizes them just enough for even friendlier everyday use, with no impact on ultimate performance. We'd thought that was enough, until Acura's Monterey Car Week reveal of a new prototype Integra Type SHRC concept. Now we're wondering whether the Type R moniker, which once adorned an Integra here in America, is off-limits for Acura. Or whether parent company Honda would be willing to loan it out for a hardcore Integra like this, while Honda Racing Corporation, HRC, nor Acura have explicitly stated an Integra Type R, or even something similar to this prototype, is headed to dealerships. You can't help but look at the Integra Type SHRC prototype and think about it. For one, the prototypes and concept cars Honda and Acura show off tend to be thinly veiled, production-ready vehicles. And show vehicles in general often hint at future products or design cues even new paint colors, trim packages, or other upgrades. Let's take a closer look at this prototype and what sets it apart from the already great Acura Integra Type S you can go out and buy today. See the HRC's exterior. If you're going to make a car based on a race car, and the Integra Type S HRC is based on the Integra Type S DE5 that races in SRO's TC America series in the TCX class, it's going to need proper aero treatment. The HRC's got it, starting with a new front bumper cover that includes a larger splitter and bigger cooling ducts. There are also larger vents on the carbon fiber hood for additional cooling and venting underhood pressure. Lessons learned from the Integra Type S DE5. Along the sides of the Integra HRC are a set of side splitters helping downforce by preventing any additional air from the body sides from flowing under the body, causing lift and additional drag. Finally, an adjustable rear wing sits atop a pair of aluminum uprights bolted onto the hatch decklid rather than the chassis itself, and the body is then shot in the NSX's Indy Yellow Pearl. Marking the first time the paint has been used on something other than Acura's supercar. To make sure you know this is an HRC-built vehicle, machined aluminum badges are found on the grill, front fenders, and decklid that feature the HRC logo. No backseat drivers allowed perhaps what is most striking is the interior of the Integra Type SHRC prototype. Up front. You'll find a pair of one-piece carbon fiber Recaro bucket seats and both driver and passenger are held in by a pair of Indy yellow seat belts. The rear seats, however, don't exist. That's right. Much like the Porsche Taycan Wysak package, the HRC prototype ditches the Type S's rear seats. In place will be a carbon fiber shelf that allows four fully mounted 19x 9.5-inch wheels and Pirelli P0 Trofeo R Ultra High Performance Tires, in 265 30ths R19, to be held behind the front seats with a strap in Indy Yellow Pearl. This includes a rear bulkhead cross chassis brace painted in the same Indy Yellow Pearl of the body. The front door panels remain the stock set found in the Integra Type S road car. But the rear door panels are replaced by a pair of carbon fiber.